Ladies and gentlemen, something a bit different today. I wasn't actually going to do a video on Red Out Lightspeed Edition, but there was an announcement that this is going to have VR support in the future, whenever that is. And this came out, this was released on the 31st of August, so a bit late. But I want to do a comparison video, so this will be the only video I do at the time for Red Out, then there will be a video for when I play it in VR. And it looks kind of like, well, Radial G Racing Revolved has been in the pipeline for ages, but it's finally got a release date and that's coming out soon. And both of these games remind me a lot of Wipeout, which I'm surprised the Omega Collection didn't have VR support. And F-Zero, if anyone remembers that. I've still actually got F-Zero X on my N64, actually. So, I might play that later, to be honest. Anyway, this game will keep me occupied for a while, because in its description on the PS Store, it's got more than 100 events, 11 game modes, and 35 race tracks, 7 racing teams, 4 racing classes, ship upgrades, and 12 power-ups. So... We've got split screen, multiplayer, quick race, practice against the AI, and career. So, let me try my luck. Let's do a quick race just to time attack. It's pure time attack. Like a time attack, but you're not allowed to equip any power-ups. Ooh. Speed, time attack event in which additional turbos. Okay. Obstacles are placed on the track, there's no respawn, don't run out of time. Insta gear, time attack event, without second chances. Wall damage is highly increased and there's no respawn. Oh. <coughs> race to the finish line. Pure race, classic race, you're not allowed to equip that. Oh. A race with no respawn, the first one to complete the race or last one alive wins. Last man standing. Long race based on points in turbo, stay ahead of the packs, we're in fun. Oh. Boss, a long race event running on five tracks, train through teleport. Huh. What was the first option again? Time attack. Be the track record times, no opponents. Well, it was the first option, so let's watch me fail. Yeah, three laps. <clears throat> and they're all locked. Cairo or Alaska? I spend a lot of time at work in the cold, so let's go somewhere hot. Oh wow, there are... Oh. oh, we'll start with the first one. Plus it looks like it's got loop-de-loop. -loop. You have to be level 6 to unlock class 2. Alright. I hope you can do some colour coordination on these. That looks like a pod racer. That looks like a throwing knife. That looks like an elongated jock strap. Oh, I wasn't even looking at stats. Uh, we'll just go with the first one. We'll go with a Vanguard. Uh, start race. No need to check on the power ups just yet. I haven't unlocked anything. I've only just brought the bloody game. Upgrading your ships and power ups is a good idea if you find an event especially tough. Which I sure as hell will. Pure events won't allow you to equip any power-ups. No shit, I just said that. Press Three, any button to two, one, go. All right, they say it's also gonna be like the fastest or maybe one of the fastest races ever. And considering I'm looking at like trying to see the speed as I'm going around turns. It does look like I'm going pretty bloody fast. I imagine a lot of people that play this in VR may get some motion sickness. I haven't suffered any motion sickness yet, but I can assume I will probably be one of those people. Stop hitting the walls, Wayne.
controls really well. I'm just keeping my finger on acceleration and not touching the brake. New record. Woohoo! I didn't really have a good look at the controls. I'm guessing since R2 is accelerate, L2, L2 is brake and reverse. So that would make square or X handbrake. Ow. Yeah, I know how to do loop loops. I've had plenty of practice on Forza Horizon 3 Hot Wheels. I'm still surprised, to be honest, that a lot of the achievements for Forza Horizon 3 Hot Wheels are still Final extremely lap. fucking rare. People New obviously record. haven't either brought the game, the DLC, or they have, and they just haven't played it. Which seems stupid because it's fun as fuck. Um, hitting the walls a bit more. Yeah, this is going to be a bad lap. Alright, X is boost. Oh, I have a health bar. Shit, I didn't even notice. Finish. New Best record. lap, one minute and four seconds. Congratulations. 896 Gold kilometers an hour. Awarded. Of course I got first place. I was the only one racing. <laughs> Woo! Me and my clones got first, second and third. Oh, I didn't check leaderboard. Shit. Uh, what was the leaderboard for that one? You have never... No, no shit. Global position. Wait a minute, what? Yes, I have. I just raced it, you ass. Telling me I don't have a leaderboard. You have never raced it. I just did, arsehole. Top 50. 55 seconds. Ooh. One minute two. I got one minute four. I'm not even in the top 50. Oh, bastard. No record. None of my friends are playing this. When it hits VR, I know at least five people that will play this with me. So that was... Are you sure you want to exit... Uh, yes, I do. Let's try. Ah, oh, you just got to go through that option. All right. Pure time attack, not allowed to quit. Speed, additional turbos. I right, activate it, stay above the target speed to subtract extra seconds. Obstacles are placed. Oh, let's see what that looks like. Uh, let's try... Oh, really? All right. Let's try a speedway in Alaska. So, X is boost. So, I'm guessing square is handbrake then. Survival zero opponents, 99 laps. Three, two, one, go. Right, let's start off with boosting. Oh, these are like death cubes. What happens if I hit one? 
I almost found out by accident. Oh, that just... I can't see shit. So if you hit the cubes, you're buggered. Hull integrity, 30%. I could not see where I was going. Warning, whole breach. Contender eliminated. Whole breach, I fucking got eviscerated. Gold medal awarded. But because I'm quick racing, I've got gold. Alright, just to make myself feel slightly worse. Time three? I don't even know what that means. <laughs> that is going to be a bitch to play. It's going to be fun on multiplayer, but it's going to be a bitch in career mode. Time attack event without second chances. Uh, yeah, I just figured that out. Race to the finish line. Pure race, no power-ups. Arena race, no respawn. First one to complete the race, the last one alive wins. Long race based on points. Hitting turbo stand ahead of the pack, swimming past his laps. Chain through teleporters. Yeah, let's keep it like that for now. Uh, let's keep it that. Oh, it's all tracks. All right, then. Wait a minute. Now, we didn't get to see much of Alaska, so... The reason why I skipped all the other ones is mainly because it's like the same thing, just with additions or subtractions on what happens. So, three, two, one, go. Excuse me, motherfuckers. I should really learn to break. I'm not gonna do. Ow. My ship is getting pulverized. I should learn to use brake. Oh, stay on the track, stop. Where are we going? Where are we going? 990 kilometers an hour. God damn. Does my health come back? It don't look it. Yeah, it does. It does. Oh, crazy lord. It doesn't help when you keep hitting walls, Wayne. That was a teleport, all right. I'm out of control. And I'm in seven. Or eight. God damn it. Danger. Yeah, I know, I'm fucking up. And I blew up. So we've had one teleport so far that I visibly noticed. And I just suck at breaking. I'm guessing square is... Okay, square didn't really break. No, square doesn't break. What the fuck is the break? What's the handbrake? Whoa, what the fuck? Ah, uh, ow, ow, ow. Alright, square is definitely not handbrake, but X is boost, so... Alright, that was a teleport. 
No, I just fucked that one up royally. Danger. What is fucking handbrake? Look back, turbo strafe pitch. There is no handbrake. No. Ah. Camera is triangle. Oh, I want to see this cockpit view. Yes, there is. All right, this in VR, this is going to be my view when I play it in VR. So be warned. What does it look like when you blow up in first person? Danger. Finish. Oh, I didn't even get to see what it looked New like when record. I blow up in first person. That sucks. Yeah, I know I arrived eighth. Because it turns out there's no fucking handbrake. Now we're going to continue. So, triangle is camera. Yes, I'm fully aware, arsehole. Right, square is power up. Circle is look back. I doubt I'll ever use that. L1 is turbo? Oh, L1 and X are turbo. Alright. I got you. <clears throat> Split screen. There's no one else in the house with me at the moment. The missus is at work. Play some points each lap. The contender is eliminated. That would be me. A race with no respawn, first one to complete the race, or last one alive wins. That would not be me. Good to train your racing fundamentals. I'm tempted to just do a race that would... Oh! What was that? Obstacles are placed on the track. Let's do that with first person and see what that looked like when I... Uh, Ate shit and everything just the screen looked distorted. Let's see what that looks like in first person. Because I want some training for when I hit this in VR. <laughs> 990 kilometers an hour. Three, two, one. Go! Alright, let's... I missed it. Not gonna miss you. Oh, that looks hor... That's gonna look horrifying in VR. Integrity 50%. Good. Let's get it lower. While still trying to look like we're actually attempting to race. I just want to blow up. Ball integrity 30%. Good. Let's get it lower. Oh, I missed it. There's got to be one on here. Oh, there wasn't one on the loop. Reach. What does it look like when I blow up? Come on. Contender eliminated. Oh, it takes you out of first person. Damn gold it. Gold medal awarded. This is an easy way to get gold medals. I wonder if there's a trophy for that. So, yes. Let's go back to main menu. Become the best red-out racer. I severely doubt that in my case. Congratulations on entering the Solar Red Art Racing League, Rookie. Your first ship will be sponsored. You may purchase the others by winning races. 
Each team has its own strengths and weak spots, so choose carefully. Select your starting ship now. Okay. Right, acceleration, max speed, grip structure. That's a very slow one. I'm gonna have to go with the Vanguard still. The Vanguard is an amazing all-rounder, featuring good handling and a... Yes, I know. You are now ready to race. Select an event from the Trophia next event Vanguard. menu. More events will unlock as your pilot level increases. You will gain experience, fame and money for each race completed. Can I... Ship colours? No, I want the colours of Enyor. That's close, that's not, that's not, that's not. Wait, what? No. Nothing in the library immediately? Will I have to create my own? Wait, what? What the fuck is going on? I said ship colours, arsehole. You can't do like your own set colours. Oh. Please tell me that's going to be something you can do in the future. See, that's, that's close, but nah. Oh, that could be it. So, Revenge of the Ship on Danger. I'll remember that. See, if you had the option to pick your own colours, that would be nice. That may have to be it. What one's that? Golden Lime on camo. Dark Ruby. That... Camo Dark Ruby so far is... La da da dee 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 da. Oh. Alright, Vine Revenge of the Ship just got my thumbs up. Or did Mecha? Wild didn't. Oh, that looks sexy as hell to me. It's a beautiful car, the looking motherfucker. God, there are so many things. Stock. Nah, fuck you. Ness looks pretty cool, but not enough orange. Slash ginger for me. That looks pretty sick. Exo. I'm gonna have to go EXO. <clears throat> Play it 
plenty of orange and black and the blue. Yes. Here what you can spend your fortune to upgrade your ship. Each ship can be upgraded in four areas. Engine, magnets, structure, energy. Structure. Yes. Okay. So three and a half grand to get upgrades. All right. Well, I'm happy with how my ship looks now. I've got my colors of Enyor. Look at that sexy beast. Unlockable power-ups at level three. It's going to be a time trial, but that will be... Actually, no, I said this is going to be the only video I do, and then I'm going to do a VR comparison. So, this is read out. <coughs> it is available for the price of $34.99 on PlayStation Store. If it's on Xbox, I don't know. I haven't checked. Uh, anything else I want to add? Yeah, shit ton of different game modes. Split screen multiplayer, but it's only 1v1. So, hopefully you've just got... A bunch of people that are willing to swap out and winner stays on. Multiplayer online. Soon to be VR. And until Radial G comes out, this will probably be the fastest racer around. I wonder if Radial G will actually go as fast as this, to be honest. And if everyone was waiting for Wipeout to get a VR patch, tough. Have this instead. Still looks pretty fun. And on that note, I shall see you all later.